Hi guys, it's Lynn here. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Now this is just a very quick video just to showcase this beautiful Euphorbia pulchina, pulchima, commonly known as the poinsettia plant with an absolutely gorgeous display of colourful red flower bracts. It is absolutely stunning and I just thought it's too gorgeous not to share. Now this is a very very common house plant that you often see around the Christmas and the New Year time and it flowers. I mean this particular one we've got we've had for three years and it usually starts to flower from sort of late November or coming to the flower bract which are these lovely colourful leaves here um, that are wrongly called flowers because a lot of people think that their leaves are actually the flowers but they're not they're actually the, the bracts. The flowers are actually right in the middle there they're tiny tiny little flowers and i think they're sort of just on their way out there has been flowering very tiny little flowers but you can't really see them now and um that's where the the lovely little the the gorgeous colorful leaves at the top the the flower bracts form and the flat tiny tiny little flowers that come out the middle and as I say, it starts to come into lovely colourful flower bracts from around sort of mid to late November. And this usually is like this then till usually the middle of February. So, um, I know last year this was like this right up until March. And then it accidentally, we had it outside because we had a lovely warm spring, a bit of a heat wave. And we put it outside in the yard with a lot of other plants. And the wind blew it off and we had to prune it right back. And these are the cuttings. And they're all flowering as well, as you can see. Lovely, beautiful red colour flower bracts there gorgeous gorgeous and people often think that this plant is just one that they have for Christmas and then it dies and they throw it away but this is a very long living plant and it can flower every single year in the right conditions and I've made a video on how to re-bloom your poinsettia euphorbia pulchima plant so do check that video out I won't go into it in this video I mentioned it all in there the links will be up above to that video and also down below in the video description because they are easy to get to re-bloom as long as you follow a few simple steps steps and um, often people say they've had euphorbia pulchima poinsettias for years and it never flowered since since after they got it after the first Christmas and New Year but they do rebloom easily so do check that video out but I just wanted to share this beauty we have this with a grow light here one of these um, LED grow lights and uh, this we just have on during the same day length hours as it would naturally be outside and then we switch it off as soon as it starts to the, the light drops so it gets its natural light levels which I also explain in the in that uh, how to get your poinsettia to rebloom video so what do you reckon guys isn't it just absolutely spectacular and I did show off the of the um, the lovely flower flower bracts when I did the how to rebloom the poinsettia video but it's looking far more sensational now than it did then so um as I say, it's well into January now and it's looking at its absolute beautiful blooming best. So guys, thank you so much for watching and for lots more tips and tricks on how to care for cacti and succulents and other types of plants, then do please subscribe to my channel and also for lots of care tips, check out my website desertplantsofavalon.com I'm going to be making a lot more how to care for on individual plant videos both on uh, this channel and also on the blogs on my website too. So I want to send you loads of love, heaps of happiness and tons and tons of plant power from across the Emerald Isle. And until my next video, bye, bye, I'm beautiful.